budget we're presenting today is our map for the year ahead. Let's begin by looking at the key items related to the general fund. We are recommending a property tax rate decrease for the coming year. Your current ad valorem property tax rate is 26.185 cents per $100 valuation. And we're proposing through this budget to adopt a rate of 24.792 cents per $100 valuation. The projected property taxes for fiscal year 2024 amount to about $28.2 million, a $1.3 million increase from the previous year. Even though we are adopting a lower tax rate, we are experiencing our second year of double-digit property value growth leading to an increase in the amount of levies we are projecting to collect. With average home values increasing from $259,000 to $319,000, the proposed tax rate would result in an increase of $112.62 on the tax bill. Property tax revenues only cover approximately 46% of the public safety budgets. Due to this, the City of Tyler relies heavily on other sources of funding for the general fund. Much of the difference is covered by the amount of sales tax we collect. The rest of the needed funds are made up of franchise fees, fines, facility rental fees, and other charges. Last year, the Council approved funding for a classification and compensation study. The Phase 1 implementation includes bringing all our civil service positions, these are your police and fire positions, to market and ensuring that current non-civil service employees are no more than 15% behind their market value. Our commitment to our largest infrastructure investment, our streets, continues with the two cents of the property tax rate set aside toward our Quality Street Commitment Fund and will provide approximately $2 million for maintenance and repairs. Additionally, this budget includes approximately $1.7 million in one-time capital fund purchases funded through savings in the current fiscal year. These capital projects include facilities and continuation of the police equipment replacement program, the purchase of two new fire engines, and replacing select medians with stamped concrete to help with maintenance. The proposed budget for fiscal year 2024 includes adjustments to our utility rates. The flat volumetric rate is designed so that each user pays the same rate for every thousand gallons used and does not reward higher volume users with lower rates. To address the capital needs of our water and wastewater system discovered in our most recent master plans, we are recommending the volumetric rates for both water and wastewater increase by 20 cents. This increase will help us pay for approximately $43 million in needed capital improvements. There are $28 million in estimated capital projects during this year. To pay for the debt required to fund these projects, the regulatory compliance fee will increase by $6.28. With the recommended changes above, we are estimating the average monthly residential bill will increase $9.16. Finally, the proposed budget includes an increase on the residential trash collection fee. We are recommending an increase of $1.85 for residential trash service. This will allow us to continue to offer a premium twice a week service to our over 31,000 customers. We focus on employees, infrastructure, public safety, and continuous improvement for our services that reflects your vision of this community.